y'all. Uh, we're going to do a Kirk Youth Package unboxing today. Um, many of you, if not all of you, received packages this weekend um, from your wonderful ministry team and maybe some youth leaders. Um, and those of you who did not receive packages, I'm hoping to get those to you this week. Uh, I wanted to go through them though, uh, so you know what's in there and understand kind of the thought process behind it. So we'll just go through this extra one that one of you will receive. Um, first, you've got this, this fabulous letter, um, and this does explain things, but attached to the back of it, you've got a few different activities. Um, you've got scripture cookies, where you, if you will look up those scriptures, you'll find out um, what the ingredients are or the measurements. You also have a nature walk option, and these are just different ways you can go take a walk outside, you can enjoy being outside, you can pray, you can have that type of devotion. Um, this week probably is not the week to do that. Uh, the weather is going to be awful, and I'm hoping the rain holds off for me to do this video right now. Um, so you'll be getting, you'll have that option in there. You also have this little blue paper. It's just a Bible scavenger hunt. Um, this could be something fun to do with your family, something to do around the dinner table, just, you know, have some fun with it. You also should have a card that is already stamped and addressed. Um, the card inside is blank. Um, mo some of you got people that are on our prayer list. If you got a prayer list person or a homebound person, you don't have a sticky note on your card. Others of you have cards that have sticky notes. This card is for one of our graduates. Um, we also have cards for our session leaders. We have cards for our staff in there. That is so that you can reach out and just say, thanks for what you're doing. I'm praying for you. Um, just send a nice note of encouragement. And you can sign it from yourself. You can sign it from the Kirk Youth, however you want to do that. Um, but this, they're stamped, so please send them. <laughs> you also to go with the card. You don't have to put it in the card, but you can. You should have received a um, little wooden flower, and that's just a fun little thing. You can color it. You can write Grow Into the Light on it. Um, it's the flower because of Grow Into the Light. And I don't see it in here. I need to finish this package. You should have some crayons or colored pencils to do that with. You can use markers, whatever you've got at home. Um, but that actually fits quite nicely inside the card if you want to send that. Um, let's see, got a few other things. You should have three little word teaser cards. These have um, scriptures on them, they have faith words, they have all kinds of things that you can discuss with your family, with your siblings. Um, I really encourage putting these on the dinner table and maybe doing one a week and making that the theme of your discussion for the week. Um, you should have gotten some chalk. We have different types of chalk that went out. Um, one of my favorite things right now has been walking around my neighborhood and seeing the chalked messages. We have some incredible artists in our neighborhood, I have learned. Um, but also just the encouragement, the pictures, the joy that that has brought. Um, I'll tell y'all when I sprained my ankle a little over a month ago, that's what I was most upset about was I couldn't go see the chalked messages and my husband makes fun of me because I always stop to take pictures of them. Um, so I encourage you to use your chalk, go outside, write a message on your sidewalk, on your patio, have some fun with it. Uh, I've seen hopscotch games. Let, let that inner kid come out. You don't have to be so serious all the time. And you also have two different, I call these VBS crafts. Um, I, I should have made one ahead of time, but you've got one craft and it's a little lantern. Um, the, oh, wait, no, 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 this is a jar. This is mustard seeds. Um, so this is a jar of mustard seeds. Um, if you remember our theme this year started with that mustard seed, the faith of a mustard seed. Um, you have instructions in the back of the pack. And if you look closely, let me see every pack you should have, where's my camera? You should have little seed beads taped onto the plastic. Don't throw away the plastic just yet until you get those seed beads off. Um, so those two things will go together for a craft. And then you have a lantern. Here's my lantern. Um, and this is the into the light part of our thing. So that was our grow. This is into the light. 
Um, it has the big blue lantern, the plastic pouch, and the cross. Um, so just two fun little crafts for you to do. Um, you can hang them up in your room, you can give them to a friend. If you have siblings, you can make them together, try not to fight. Um, and hang them up in your kitchen on your refrigerator or something as a reminder of what we've done this year and what your challenge is this summer. Um, moving stuff around. Finally, you have bendy Jesus. You can bend them, you can shake them. Jesus can go places with you. Hopefully you'll be able to go places this summer. Um, take Bendy Jesus with you. Take a picture of him. See? Um, take a picture of him uh, on your different adventures. If it's at the grocery store, if it's staying at home, if it's playing with friends. Maybe we'll actually get to travel. Um, I am going to take my Bendy Jesus to New Hampshire at the end of June, I hope and pray. Um, so take Bendy Jesus with you. Take a picture and then tag um, Kirk Youth Ministry on social media. Let me make sure I tell you right. On Instagram, it's at Kirk Youth Group. And on Facebook, it's our private Facebook page at Kirk Youth Ministry. Um, so tag those and we'll create a collage at the end of the summer of all the places that Bendy Jesus went. Um, the middle schoolers might remember the really tall cardboard Jesus that was at the rock wedding at Massanetta last year. And you know, think the same thing with Bendy Jesus. Um, there was also a little bit of candy in there, so I hope you enjoy that. Uh, but hopefully this brought you some light in your life right now. Hopefully it will bring other people light as you send the cards and make crafts and maybe share those and do the chalk. Um, be on the lookout. We might hopefully be able to get some more things to y'all throughout the summer. There are going to be some changes this summer, and that's all going to be outlined in the email. Um, so I hope you will read that, uh, mark your calendar for anything that's in the email. I haven't written it yet, so I don't know what's in it. Um, so just keep an eye on that. Stay in touch with me if you need anything. I know one thing being added to the email is, uh, we are redoing those, uh, duck donut conversations, except they will be on zoom. Um, so rather than me hanging out on zoom for hours, and nobody's showing up, we're going to just have sign-ups for 30 minute slots. If you just need some one-on-one -on -one time um, to chat with me about what's going on. I know a lot of y'all have been dealing with a lot and I want to be here for you. Um, so yeah, reach out to me, enjoy your package. It may seem kitty, but the idea is just bring out some of that joy, bring out some of that inner child um, and read your email and I will see y'all soon. You take care. Bye.